New information just in. For students and families at Arapahoe High School, crime scene tapes still up around the school as the investigation of Friday shooting wraps up, but the school deciding to cancel classes until the new year. The community's focus on 17-year-old victim Claire Davis, even the governor visiting her today in the hospital. Her family saying tonight she's in a coma, her condition remains critical, after a fellow classmate walked into the school and shot her. The tribute and pray for Claire message growing all weekend. The Arapaho High School Warriors showing their courage and their unity. 7 News reporter Russell Haythorn at the school tonight with new information for families. Right, Mike, no classes here at Arapaho High through the remainder of this semester. Students will not be required to return to class until after the new year. The principal making that announcement via email earlier this evening. Meantime, this community continues to grieve and come together. Tonight, kids like Cambry Olmer and Haley Bruce come to offer support. We don't know Claire, but we know we want to pray for her. Someone tied a Christmas stocking to the fence and filled it with pens, also hanging a notepad for people to share well wishes for Claire. It shows that the community cares. Haley and Cambry go to Heritage High, but like so many others, felt compelled to be here. Some of my best friends go to Arapaho. Just reading their posts just make me like so heartbroken. It's just hard to comprehend. Claire Davis's family says tonight she remains in critical condition. She is stable, but in a coma. Davis was shot Friday by a student who entered Arapaho High with a gun and opened fire. That student then killed himself. A tragedy becoming all too familiar in our schools, but still so puzzling. I don't understand like someone why someone would want to do something so terrible and it's just it's so hard to comprehend. We talked to Sheriff Grayson Robinson late today. He says the investigation inside the school is now complete. His agency will hand the school back over to the district tomorrow. But again, the principal announcing that classes are canceled through the remainder of the semester. Students will be allowed to return to the school later this week to retrieve their belongings. Live in Littleton, Russell Haythorn, 7 News.